Hello, my name is Margarita Esqueda and I am an incoming senior at La Jolla Community High School. My lab mentor is Dr. Mai Kana, who works in the neurodegenerative lab, but I'm specifically studying ALS. And our lab's main research question is how can we cure ALS? My lab wants to answer this question to be able to find a treatment for ALS that is effective. Currently, there is no cure for ALS, nor is there a treatment that could reverse or stop the progression of the disease. Most people with ALS die within two to five years of its diagnosis. Since the disease affects smaller cells, regular actions like speaking and moving are hindered, and eventually, patients are not able to breathe. It is estimated that 20,000 people have ALS in the United States alone. Researching TDP43's mutations is vital to finding a cure for ALS because it is present in about 95% of those patients. And so essentially, uh, in silico docking is used to predict the molecule that would help stop those interactions. And the molecule is called RTRD01. And essentially, RTRD01 binds to TDP43's RRM domains and inhibits that interaction with the protein and RNA and, or other proteins. Final questions I still have are what other small molecules can target TDP43 and RNA interactions? Could the other four compounds with high binding affinity be used in experimentation? And how might the possible discrepancies between a drosophilia model and clinical trials affect the development of a drug.